Welcome back to Beyond Seclusion. I want to talk about a company that I came across and sent me a product here, a muzzle brake. This is Hancock Armory. This is the Concord. They sent me two of these muzzle brakes. Um, you know, and I used to I used to be extremely into muzzle brakes, and not that I'm I'm not, but once I got cans, it, it sort of decreased the need or the use of muzzle brakes, but I do like them, especially when I don't have a can. Anyway, Hancock, um, one thing that, that interested me is they're all grade five titanium. So, I mean, this thing is light as a feather. It's 1.24 ounces. This is the 556 one. I've got one mounted on a 762 you can see here. And anyway, what they claim with this, aside from being titanium, which means you absolutely have no rust, no corrosion, no issues whatsoever there. They're price reasonable. They're around $64.99, at least just straight from the site. I didn't do a big research to see where else I could find them. Um, but they also claim to extremely minimize muzzle rise and also perceived recoil. Now, that is something that a lot of us are interested in. Now, there's been a lot of stuff out there over the years, um, you know, the recoil eliminator, the tank brakes, and a lot of these work, but they're also extremely loud. So, all we really can do is put this to the test, um, check, we'll do some slow-mo, we'll check on the muzzle rise, you know, try it with and without slow-mo vid, and then uh, also perceived recoil, you know, and then we'll see what we've got. <laughs> okay, I got glasses on now. Um, it definitely feels like less recoil. I'm not going to know until I take it off, but uh, if you saw the flames coming out the side of this are huge, and it, I'm going to be honest, it is loud. With that said, this is a 762 by 39 with a 7 inch barrel. This may not have been the best choice for this particular brake. Um, we're going to take that off and then we're going to check on the recoil. It does feel, uh, at least I think, less, but I won't know till I pop that off and try a few more. Okay, so we're going to give this muzzle brake a try here. We've got my PSA KS47, a 762 by 39. As you saw in the bag, it did a really good job. We've got some huge flash out here to the side, but that's, you know, we're running a seven inch barrel. If I had a, div, uh, a longer barrel, it wouldn't be an issue, but uh, I'm gonna be shooting steel, so I need the glasses anyway. Um, let's just see how it does, see how it feels, uh, you know, dumping, dumping a full mag. Okay, to start off the test, I'm using some South Korean military surplus, NATO spec, 308 full metal jacket. I've got the original buffer. So essentially we have no uh, compensatory mechanism in this for recoil. I'm gonna flip the camera around. We'll do a slow-mo. Hopefully you can see, you know, the, the recoil into my arms and my body. We'll do four shots. OK, 
Okay, so now I'm gonna try it with the Hancock Armory. We got the 30 cal muzzle brake on there. Same thing, we're gonna do it slow motion and see how that does for the recoil. <laughs> okay, I can't wait to see the video and the recoil. I don't need to see the video to tell you that that significantly decreased recoil. I'd say it, at least 50%. It also <laughs> made it really loud. Okay, it makes it really loud. And you got huge fireballs shooting out the side. Now, granted, this is a pistol, so I got a 10-inch barrel. I still like it though. I mean, it, it really does decrease the recoil. I, I'm super impressed with that. Um, you know, you're gonna have to think about that if you're gonna stick it on a short barrel. On a longer barrel, absolutely, okay? If you wanna decrease recoil, that is a quick, cheap, easy way to do it. If you're at a public range, the guys to the right and the left of you are probably not gonna like you very much but you know what i'm on my own range and i don't care um if you're out shooting if you're out hunting you know whatever that's impressive um so there you go hey if you're new to beyond seclusion you've got to check out our webpage. it's the home of the crazy stupid deals anytime i find good deals on these this is where i post them i've got an amazon page a lot of times which has just some killer prices you can look on there see if this is i haven't seen the romeo 8 on amazon yet but i do have my romeo 5 and some of the romeo 4s um, also check these out these are my online courses this is what helps support beyond seclusion if you just click on them they're in the description it drives them up in the search engine so people can find them when they're doing like a google search um, if they're interested you know they buy them they're the 30-day money back guarantee uh, use our links on the home page all this helps uh, you know support beyond seclusion helps me buy ammo and keeps the reviews coming hancock armory muzzle brake decreasing recoil two thumbs up five stars absolutely i agree hands down that decreases recoil at least 50 percent do not shoot that especially with a short barrel without hearing protection you're going to be deaf as a post and just again heads up at a public rifle range the guys to your right and your left they're not going to be real fond of you hopefully you found this helpful be sure to like comment sub I love Hancock's stuff, their muzzle brakes. I can't wait for them to come out with one for my 450 Bushmaster. Guys, give me one for the 450 Bushmaster, and I really want to try one on my 9mm, uh, my PCs, also uh, my CMMG 45. Would love to try some of these. Until next time, happy shooting, be safe. Again, special thanks, Hancock Armory. Love it, guys. Till next time.